welcome along to you that are still going for this car i know a lot of people have stopped going for it because it is so expensive and in hindsight i probably should have really stopped going for this already or just done racing dollars because this car is just not worth it uh but i'm going to keep going i've only got two days to go so i'm going to keep going <clears throat> but i think i've made a bit of a mistake here carrying on with this thing especially after it, the way it drove last night if it drives like that today then i've obviously got some big issue but see how we go anyway first one is a hunter can't damage your car and it looks like we're I can't remember where it said we're on now that looks like brains out you again oh yeah it said Melbourne didn't it well it definitely weren't Melbourne oh that's why it's saying without a scratch you can't crash it well so if that drove like it did yesterday I've got no chance in getting this round the track. I've not actually even been on the game today. I've only done a um, speed snap just to, you know, log into your daily login thing. I tried briefly yesterday, even putting, this is how desperate I was, I tried putting on a steering assist and it made it instantly probably five times worse than what it was. It was really weird. This actually feels alright today. doesn't really matter where you catch that red car, he's going to be in the way. Let's slow down here a little bit, I think. He's going to be in the way, regardless of wherever you catch him, I think, on there. 